Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you're looking to become a U.S. citizen, then you need to start studying 100 civics, history and government questions. In this video, we're going to share with you a random selection of 100 civics questions for the naturalization test. This way, you can get started studying and be prepared for the test in just a few short months. The civics test is an oral test, and the USCIS officer will ask the applicant up to 10 of the 100 civics questions. An applicant must answer 6 out of the 10 questions correctly to pass the civics portion of the naturalization test. After watching this video, you'll be ready to take the civics test and start your journey to U.S. citizenship. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Kamala Harris. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific Ocean. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. Who was the president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty. What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of speech, freedom of religion. What is the economic system of the United States? Market economy. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Civil War. Who was in charge of the executive branch? The President. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15. What territory did the U.S. buy from France in 1803? Louisiana. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House of Representatives. 
What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? U.S. Diplomat What is one responsibility that is only for U.S. citizens? Vote in a federal election We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. Who was the first president? George Washington. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Answers will vary. Please visit this link. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Free the slaves. When must all men register for the Selective Service? At age 18. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because they have more people. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. We elect a president for how many years? During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism In what month do we vote for president? November What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. Who is the father of our country? George Washington. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Cherokee. Who vetoes bills? The President. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Joe Biden. If both the President and the Vice President can no longer serve, who becomes President? The Speaker of the House. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Mississippi River. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. Who is the commander-in-chief of the military? 
The President. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Education, Secretary of Labor. Name one U.S. territory. Guam. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Give a driver's license. What is the capital of your state? Answers will vary. To find the capital of your state, please visit Name two national U.S. holidays. New Year's Day, Christmas. What major event happened on September 11th, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Kevin McCarthy. When was the Constitution written? 1787. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Name one branch or part of the government. President. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Be loyal to the United States. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War I. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote, run for office. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Said that the United States is free from Great Britain. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? 
the vice president. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? July 4th, 1776. How many U.S. Senators are there? 100. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 435. What did Martin Luther King do? Fought for civil rights. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. Who makes federal laws? Congress. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All the people of the state. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Free the slaves. What does the President's Cabinet do? Advises the President. Name your U.S. Representative. Answers will vary. Please visit What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for civil rights. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil Rights Movement. Under our Constitution, 
Some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. How many amendments does the U.S. Constitution have? 27. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. Who is the governor of your state now? Answers will vary. Please visit Name one state that borders Mexico. New Mexico. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. What is the political party of the president now? Democratic Party. Who signs bills to become laws? The president. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. John Jay. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? 18 and older. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. Thank you for watching. Good luck, everyone. Bye.